Okay, so hi guys. Um, so this is a very different problem. Now in, in vector calculus and also, well, in vectors, you also have to know how to find the component of u along v, okay? So this is what we're going to do in this problem. So to quickly um, explain what... Um, the component of u along along v is so this is a little like proof i would say um so basically the only thing you need to focus on is the fact that the magnitude of u times the cosine of theta equals um u dot v over the magnitude of v now um this, the simple definition for the projection of u onto v, or the component of u along v, excuse me, the projection is something else. So basically you're going to do um, components of, so it's comp sub v of u equals u dot v over the magnitude of v. That's what it is. That's just the component of, of um, of u along v, okay? So just remember this formula. I mean, don't try to, like, prove it or anything because you don't have to prove all of this. Like, I just wanted to show you where that where this came from, but yeah. So in this problem, we want to use that formula to find the component of u along v, right? So we have to do u dot v, right? And u dot v is just, if we have u equals 1, 4, vector 1, 4, and v is the vector negative 2, 1. u dot v is going to just be 1 times negative 2 plus 4 times 1. Okay, so sorry about that, guys. Oh my goodness. So, um, u dot v, that's just going to be, so we have Oops. So we have u dot v is equal to, so basically it's going to be 1, 4, so 1, 4 dot negative 2, 1 over, and then we do the magnitude of v, so it's going to be square root of negative 2 quantity squared plus 1 quantity squared. So then we have this is going to be equal to um, 1 times negative 2 plus 4 times 1 over and then it's going to be the square root of 4 plus 1 so it's going to be negative 2 plus 4 over the square root of 5, right? And then it's going to be 2 over the square root of 5. Now, you can rationalize the denominator, and doing that will give you 2 square root of 5 over 5. So, so the component of u along v would be 2 square root of 5 over 5. So this is your final answer here. Okay. All right, guys. Sorry about that. I um, I um, you know, basically, I had issues with one note, like always. But um, I hope this helps. If you guys have any questions, um, please let me know, and uh, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.